everybody, it's Betty here. Um, I'm making the other YouTube video that I said I'm making my last one. We are doing how to play this game. I actually don't know how, so let's get on. We're just going to open this up. Where did I stick those scissors? Up here. Okay, so we're just going to open this up like this. So there we go. Now there's a little flap that we can just pull down on. So This was in that bag of stuff I got from my recital. And just in case you didn't watch the other video yet, um, I had my recital today and got some presents. Okay. Let's check it out. It's called Sleeping Queen. A royal losing card game. Doctor Dot Toy, Smart Play, Smart Toy. Product of Agriments. Sleeping Queen. Rise and Shine, the Pancake Queen. The late ladybug queen and ten of their closet friends have fallen under a sleeping spell. And it's your job to wake them up. Use straight strategy, strategy quick thinking and a little luck to raise these napping now, yeah, you get the point. These words are like really tiny, so it's hard to read. They're like teeny tiny. So, I won't open it yet. So, let's open it. what the inside looks like not too interesting sorry that gave you a lot of view but we'll take these out these are the directions pretty sure this is a matching game oh game line oh it's just a thingy for um other games like it so we I'm just gonna take these cards out of this. Oh look at and underneath the cards has a little thing. This part comes up, but I'm gonna leave that in to stick the cards in. So here are our cards. We won't open them yet. Now let's first read the directions. And sleeping queens. Ages eight and up. Two to five players. <laughs> okay. So, rules of play context. Queen, kings, risers, sleeping pawns, hands, dragons of each number, one through ten. Object. Object. The object of the game is... The object. The object of the game is to be the first player to... Collect five queens or have 50 points in a two to three player game or collect four queens to have 40 points in a four to five player game or have the most points when all the queens have been awakened. Set up. We'll look at that. The first time you play, look through the deck to get familiar with the cards. Note that each queen has a different point value and that there are also king, knight, dragon, jester, sleeping, potent, and wand cards as well as number cards, 
for 1 through 10. S separate the cards into two decks according to card deck. Shuffle the 12 queen cards, green backs, and place them face down asleep. In the center of the playing area in four rows of three, then shuffle the red deck back deal five cards to each player and I think it's begin. So I understand how to play now and I'll explain it better than I did. So set your cards up like this. on this side. Sorry, we don't have names here. So, scissors and mint. So, yeah. So, I'm going to write S and M. Let's find something to write on. Mm, you know, we'll write on this. Okay, so we have scissors and mint. We don't have names, so we just had to figure something. So we have scissors and mint. So here we go. I'm gonna pull for scissors first. <clears throat> Here's the card, I'll let you see it before me. Oh, what's it say? Oh, that's just the people who made this game, sorry. Let me pull for scissors again. Oh. I got a wand card and it says that a wand card, the first time you play with it, 